hello guys welcome to my channel today we are going to see how to fix pubg battlegrounds stock on loading screen let's fix it guys first step is to verify your game files to do this you just need to open up steam right click on the pubg and select properties select installed files and select verify integrity of game files after getting done just to close stuff here the second step is to update graphics drivers. You just need to make sure your graphics card drivers are up to date. To do this, you just need to open up GeForce Experience. If you not have GeForce Experience, then you just need to check my video description for the download link. For AMD users, you just need to open up the AMD software. Select the driver tab and select check for updates. If you have any available update listed over here, then you just need to update it and make your graphics card up to date, guys. After doing it, close stuff here. The third step is to clear temporary files. Clearing temporary files can help free up resources and resolve issues. To do this, go to search menu and type run. Click on open it. In run window, you just need to type percentage temp percentage. Click on OK to open up. In here, you just need to click on any folder over here and press in keyboard Ctrl plus A to select all and then right click on it and select delete it. Select do this for all current items and select skip. After getting done, just to close stuff here. The fourth step is to adjust launch options. Add specific launch options in Steam can resolve the problem. To do this, you just need to open up Steam. Right click on the PUBG and select properties. Now you just need to check my video description for this launch option used in my video. Just to copy and paste it under the launch options. After pasting it, click on outside and just to close stuff here. The fifth step is to disable overlays. Disable any overlays such as Steam, Discord, GeForce Experience as they can sometimes cause issues. To disable the Steam overlay, you just need to open up Steam, right click on the PUBG and select properties. Enable the Steam overlay while in game, you just need to disable it and after that just to close stuff here. The sixth step is to increase virtual memory. To do this, go to search menu and type sysdm.cpl. Comes up control panel item, click on open it. Select advanced tab under the performance select settings. Select advanced tab under the virtual memory select change. In here you just need to uncheck this option guys. Automatically manage baking file size for all drives. And then in this drive list you just need to select a C drive. And after that you just need to select a custom size. Now you just need to know how much RAM installed on your PC. For that, you just need to go to search menu and type about your PC, click on open it. In my case, 16 GP of RAM installed in my PC. After checking that, close stuff here. Now you just need to check my video description for these values used in my video. Just to copy the values depending on how much RAM you have. Just to copy it, install a size. And after copying it, copy and paste the install a size value. And now Copy the maximum size value and paste in the maximum size over here. And after pasting both values, select set and the values should be listed under the pegging file size. And after that, click on OK. Click on OK. Click on OK. The sound step is to reinstall DirectX and Visual C redistributables. To do this, you just need to check my video description for the download link. Select the language and select the download option. Scroll down. If you are using 64 bit, then you just need to click on this link. If you are using 32 bit operating system, then you just need to click on this link. After getting download done, you just need to install both applications and after that, just to close stuff here. The eighth step is to adjust power settings. To do this, go to search menu and type run. Click on open it. In run window, you just need to type power cfg dot cpl click on ok to open up in here you just need to select the high performance after that just to close stuff here 
I hope one of these steps to fix your problem guys if the video helped you don't forget to leave a like guys you can also subscribe me and support me guys thank you